Okay, so in this one we're finding the selling price based on the percentage profit. Uh, setting the scene here, you're a shopkeeper again. Um, you're a shopkeeper, you've bought something for a certain amount of price and you want to sell it for a certain profit. Let's take a look at a question. Uh, keep in mind, you're a shopkeeper. Okay, a shopkeeper buys a pair of shoes for $80. Okay, so he went to the wholesaler, 80 bucks. here's the pair of shoes. He wants to make a 20% profit. How much should he charge or she charge? How much should you charge because you're the shopkeeper? Uh, now, for a question like this, first of all, we need to find 20% of $80 because we want to make that 20% profit. Uh, so, um, profit, let's change our color there so we can differentiate it a bit better. So profit in dollars equals uh, the cost price times the percentage profit. Now the cost price is $80, that's easy. Now when you do the percentage profit in this type of question, you really need to make sure that you express it as a decimal, not as a percentage. So 20% is going to be 0.2. Okay, now if you type that into your calculator, 80 times 0.2, that'll be $16. Now, stop there for a minute, think about it. You're a shopkeeper, you bought a pair of shoes for $80. Now, if you want a 20% profit, you're going to need to make $16. Now, we can figure out our sale price pretty simply. That's going to be the cost price plus the dollar profit. So in this case, our cost price was $80. That's how much we paid for the shoes. Now we want a profit of $16. So that means that on our price sticker, we better put $96. Okay, this is very, very real world. It's, it's, it's exactly what happens in the real world. You go and buy a pair of shoes for 80 bucks. You want to make a 20% profit. So you figure that out, that you need to make $16. So on the sticker in the shop, you'll put 80 plus 16, which is $96. Buy your shoes for 80, sell them for 96, and you'll be a happy shopkeeper. Uh, that's finding the selling price based on the percentage profit.